Hello everybody and welcome to August is Peach Month, which for 31 days I'm going to be trying out peach stuff. Today is day 6. And we have a product called Yum Earth Organic Pops. I think I paid 4 or 6 dollars for this. It wasn't the cheapest in the world. And that's interesting. There's a pumpkin. No, not. I don't know. It looked like pumpkin, but I think it says perfectly peach. But anyways, um, they're organic pops. Uh, it's vegan certified. No peanuts, no tree nuts, no high fructose corn syrup. Four flavors assortment may vary. Whatever that means. Made in a peanut free facility with no soy, no egg, no dairy. Um, honest commitment, variety, quality, passionate, yada yada yada. We promise to always keep it sweet and simple. Try other products and share your thoughts with us on yumearth.com. I might share this video on their website if they'll allow it and this is also gluten free um, serving size is three yes three pops or suckers or lollies as some other people might call it um, whoa produced January 9th 2017 wow this is fresh. That that's insane. Most of the places they like make it sit around for like a year, six months in a year, I think. Like especially Halloween candy. Crazy. And um certified organic by Oregon Tilth and it says this product in Mexico. I was hoping it was products of America, but the company is based out of Stanford, Connecticut. It's probably just offices. You probably know some other famous people who are in Stanford, Connecticut. Huh. I guess that's where people who can't get into Hollywood go. It's like the other Hollywood or something. I don't know. Um, it says only 20 calories per pop, which is cool. Um, there's a Snapchat, Yum Earth, and Facebook, Yum Earth. Um, the ingredients, organic cane sugar, that's a plus. Organic brown rice, or, oh, rice syrup, okay, for sweetness. Citric acid, that's normal, azorbic acid, normal, natural flavors. Concentrate carrot and black currant. Okay. Color organic anato for color. I don't know. But it doesn't say anything about the flavors that are in here, which I'm about to read. But I don't know. We'll see. Um. There's pomegranate pucker. I like pomegranate juice. Perfectly peach. Hence why I got this. Strawberry smash. That sounds good too. Very, very cherry. Kind of like cherry. Now, before I get into this, I'm going to tell you a little story. Um, back in 98 or 99, the... Southside Walmart, which would have been at the time the Nifong Walmart, which now a uh, High V resides there, which I'm glad High V recycled the building. They actually recycled two uh, buildings here that I can think of. They only built a brand new one on West Broadway. Uh, the other one that they recycled, which I wish, I wish, I wish I would have got footage of this place, but it, um, they recycled the old Mega Market. It took forever 
before something went in there. Um, but anyways, back to my story. Around that time, I uh, was like, you know, taking my mother in there and stuff, shopping around, which I miss those days. Because I also miss the smaller Walmarts. They had like less people in them. And they had a lot more variety of, of the small little trinket stuff and off the wall stuff, which you cannot find in today's super Walmarts. I really do miss the little Walmarts. I kind of wish I would bring back some of the small Walmarts. But anyways, um, on this like corner rack where they hang up the, the bags, I don't know what those things called. They got a new product in. And they had two. And I think the first time, and I, I mentioned this in other videos, I think also from Hank Cargo's video, but they had a product called Juice Fools. Well, there was only two flavors at the store, and nobody else in town, no other store had this. So... I, I picked up an apple. I think I could be wrong. I can't remember that part. But I definitely got one peach. There was like three bags of each. So I checked out. I like At that time, I, I, I still love peach. And I tried it. I was like, oh my god, this is so good. It tastes like a real juicy, awesome peach. And I got to the center and all of a sudden, this like goo stuff come out. And it's just like, boom, instant orgasm in my mouth it was just insane the flavor they supposedly used real fruit in it real fruit juice hence the name juicefuls well the next time we went there they had three bags and I bought every single one this stuff was so good well kept going back getting it getting it all of a sudden they just stopped carrying it it's like what's going on and then things happen or whatnot I, I kind of forgot about it until not that long ago and then I decided um, to google it it took me a long time to find out what it was because I could not remember the name juicefuls well finally I hit it it's like okay this is cool so I followed the rabbit hole. The white rabbit. Eat, take your pick. Matrix or Alice in Wonderland. Depending on your age. Um, so I followed it. It said it was bought out by some other company. They they closed Juicefuls and whatever products they made. Um, excuse me. Um, then that company or conglomerate or whatever was going bankrupt or something and by the way I forget what movie but there's at least one movie out there in the 90's that had in this like little uh, convenience store that had a display of juicefuls and it's like oh wow but um After I was like doing all this research, saying I went to this company, I looked up that company, and went to that company. It was bought by some German company. Well, they completely decided to X out the whole entire line. And they they still make it, but they do not sell their products here in the States. Well, they make something similar. It basically looks like the Hall's Cough Drop. But it has nothing to do with cough drops. It's just the way the package and the things are. They no longer make peach. And this company has been, I think it's set around for 120 years or something like that. I forget what the company is. But again, um, it's German based. Um, and I, I've looked high and low recently to find similar things, and all I can find is the gummy stuff. And I, if something is really, really good, like a piece of candy, I'd rather suck on it 
for longer than just like chew it and swallow it and be done with it, you know? Um, so there's three, two or three places online, which I'll, I'll get some in this series. One is, I think it's called Butterfields. They're called Peach Buds. I think they're hard candy. This company has been around for over a hundred years. And they're supposed to be really, really good. It's supposed to be very simple ingredients. If it tastes 100% like Juicefuls, they are sold. And the other one is through Oriental Trading. They have peach barrels. I don't know. And then I forget the third place, but there's a third place that sells peach. There's also like the candy cane versions and some other ones. I, I, I've i tried other fruit flavors of candy canes and it just tastes yeah, artificially. So, excuse me again. So, um, there's also some other ones. There was some kind that was very expensive. I can't remember what it was right now. But, uh, you know, those strawberry filled ooze things? I've been trying to find desperately to find peach ones. There's supposed to be some out there. And Cargo um, is probably going to get me some. They're not filled with anything, but they're a peach hard candy, but you had to buy the multi pack. To get the peaches which I don't know why but um there there was also a Japan hard candy that did the peach I looked it up on Amazon and eBay unfortunately it looks like they no longer make it or at least the sellers that are selling it do not sell it they're all sold out there's also um there was another kind of um Um, I forget what it was, a, a German candy or something, I forget that part, but um, um, wait, oh, heart something, I don't know. If it, if it's hard candy or whatever, but it's quite expensive for one box. It's like thirty dollars, thirty three dollars. I'm kind of iffy on it because what if it's bad? I kind of wish that was like a smaller container to try. But those are my options to try. Um, but yeah. Anyway, sorry for the long story. I really, really miss Juiceful. So does a lot of other people. I even tried eBay. And there's nothing. The, the only thing that comes up with like pictures and stuff on, on Google and, and people's blogs about it, trying to find similar products. So I'm going to make it my mission to find a similar product to Juicefuls. And hopefully we'll get out there. If there's something exactly like Juicefuls. But yeah, let's get into this. Okay, that's very interesting. It honestly smells like my old... It wasn't old, it was a brand new apartment. But my old apartment in Lynn, Missouri when I was going to college. It, it's just weird. It This brings back so many memories. Oh, I'm so happy. It, it's like, wow... Oh, wow. Mm. Oh, the memories. Anyways, uh, let's, let's get in this. Sorry for reminiscing. Uh, 
I guess I'll try all of them. There's Strawberry Smash. Okay, there's supposed to be like five. Uh, there's Pomegranate... Uh, pomegranate Pucker. Uh, always one on filming. Always one on filming. There's... There's Perfectly Peach. Oh, by the way... My subscribers to my YouTube says, stop being rude, please. Uh, this is you. That was for you. I forget your name at the moment. I'll put it right here on the screen. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm looking for the very cherry now. And... There it is. There's very, very cherry. So, let's... and I'm in the middle of making a video. But how? How is this? How am I being rude to you when I'm already in the progress of doing something? Why is that more important than what I'm doing for me? It's your food! I'll be back. Well, guess what? After that, after she said it was about my food and stuff, she just stopped talking. So, I don't know. I don't know what it was about. Um, anyways... <laughs> Even though I'm doing this video for August, it is right now February 7th. Which, uh, in short, Brother Voodoo, aka Paul Ryder, he's getting another evaluation, and I pray to God he'll be home. Um, you may never see this, Paul. You may see this, I don't know. But at this point in time, I'm praying for you. And if I never see you again, I'll still be praying for you. You're a damn good guy. And thank you for your service, sir. Anyways, guys, back to Yum, or Yum Earth Organic Pop. This one is cherry. These reminds me of almost those safety pops. Remember those? I don't think they exist anymore. But it kind of sucks. Look, look how small it is. I can see why there's like no calories. Now if you could find this like this for the peach. It'd be cool. But here we go. It's actually really, really good. I like it. Okay. Cherry is a plus. Now I'm gonna go for the pomegranate. There was one time I had pomegranate juice. It was sweet, but you could taste it. I don't don't remember what it was from, so I decided to try actual pomegranate. I did not like it because the seeds. I mean, I don't mind it, but I didn't like it, though. Crunk, crunk, crunk. But, um, then I decided one time to buy a bottle. I, I think it was Palm, or Palm, P-O-M, of pomegranate juice. It was $13. I'm like, wow, that's expensive. But when I was started drinking it, it was extremely tart. So I don't know what I had the first time I tried pomegranate, unless it was a mixed juice. I can't remember. Anyways, here's pomegranate pucker. Hmm. 
not bad. I actually like it. It's actually sweet compared to the actual um the juice and stuff. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna go with the strawberry smash. Yeah, dare I clear my palette? Okay. It kind of looks like strawberries and cream. There's like a hint of like pink on there. But yeah, they. I think these would be really good for kids, but the price, I don't know, but here we go. Very, very good peach. Very good. Oh, this kind of sucks. I'm, I'm looking at how many pops. I wonder if it's random, but this bag I got, four pomegranate, four very, very cherries, three strawberries, and three peaches. Can't want them all. Mm. Strawberry is awesome. And if you look at them close, they're labeled for individual sale. So it's kind of neat. So. Let's try the perfect peach. Again, it looks like peaches and cream. Strange, it doesn't smell like anything, but here we go. Okay. I'm going to say, so far, if you're looking for juice fulls, this is, the, since I haven't tried any other peach hard candy yet, but as of right now, this is by far my number one choice. If you love juice fulls, get yourself Yum Earth Organic Pops. I'm going to do my best to see if they sell peach individually. That would drive me bananas. But this tastes just like Juice Fools. At least the outer hard coating. Oh my god. Mmm. 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 Wow. Mmm. So awesome. So awesome. Mm. Mm. All right, guys. Um, again, these were Yum Earth Organic Pops. Pomegranate Pucker, Perfectly Peach, Strawberry Smash, Very, Very Cherry. All with natural flavors. So, again, if you want an alternative to juicefuls or replacement for juicefuls try this product it is amazing amazing perfectly peach i'm sold it's a little bit pricey 
at least in this bag you only get three. Like I said, I'm going to try my best to find uh, either just a little hard candies or something, but so far this is the perfect alternative. Alright guys, that's it for now. Signing off. I love you all. Bye.